Good morning from Hawaii. I'm here at Maui, Maluku, at uh, Mark's house, just out on his lanai. Looks out over the harbour, the sun's coming up. Just about to head over to his place, Loft 145, and uh, give a class, do a demonstration there for all the guys that work with him, and a couple of other guys from different salons that we've met along the way. Really looking forward to it, it should be good fun. Uh, probably just be like an hour or two, um, and then we're heading out, we're going over to Lahaina today, I think, or Kihei to go to a uh, now later on, which is a, a luau, sorry, later on, which is like a, a party dance, uh, like hula stuff, traditional Hawaiian food. So it's gonna be a really good, fun, filled day, and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna head out now because they're calling me to get going. Getting the guys doing some problem solving so I can make the class as bespoke as possible. I find that I go start wet, wash the hair, clean, cleanses the hair completely. It's a nice experience for the client, and they're nice and relaxed. And then I can put in a blank canvas, a base, which I would do if I was doing the same haircut on five guys. I would do that blank canvas and that base first, then dry it off, and then personalise it to the individual. see how thick his hair is. So just removing that little bit of bulk on the ends will make it a little bit softer. It'll also release that curl. So that's the training done with Mark's place at Loft 145. I think I remember really well. We did like a, a taper on uh, like a curly hair taper. Um, really good. I think he's, his hair was real nice. It's a little bit of a challenge for me working with curly hair because I don't get to do it very often. But the class are really responsive and I think they got a lot out of it. So. All in all, I think it was a very good day. Uh, well, good morning. Now we've got the rest of the day. We're just headed back to Mark's place so I can get changed out of this, put some shorts on and go out and enjoy a bit of the sun that's come out. So class is over. We're over at Cafe Ole on the, uh, what do they call it, the dunes? Is this the dunes, Mark? The dunes okay. at Cafe Ole. And it's quite a nice view sat outside here. That's all of Waiuku. And then what they call up on the foothills in Waiuku Heights. Okay. okay. Thank you. Very good thing. So the house is on the foothill under the cloud. It's called Waiuku Heights. And um, also the house is towards the beginning is uh, Mawalani. And then the golf course is a community golf course. Anybody can come to it. Oh, brilliant. It's not private. It's very beautiful. And it's gorgeous weather, despite the clouds hugging the mountain. <laughs> it's gorgeous. And then here come. Laurie and Jenna are just coming back now. They escaped for a walk. Mark's gone to find them. Time for some beach action. Hey, this is where we went out in the where we went out to watch the whales out here. Yeah, because that's where we came out over there. Oh, yeah. Here we are at the beach of Kihei. I've switched over to the GoPro. I'm gonna head in. Get the water. It's a little bit chilly. <laughs> Alright, 
upstairs. It's pretty clear. I'm just gonna go for it. That's good. I wonder if there's anything under the water. I wonder if there's anything under the water. You see the massive manta rays they were showing on the videos they were watching. Seriously crazy. I'm just sat in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, just chilling by myself. The water's good and warm. It's warmed up a lot now, although the uh, clouds have come over, but the weather's beautiful. And just surrounded by all these amazing islands and palm trees here in Kihei. Seriously beautiful. Unreal. It's quite hippie-ish kind of looking this bit. Yeah, but you know, the weather's good and you can live off the fruit here, couldn't you? Yeah, it'd be awesome. I mean, even the bad weather we had, they could still, you know, hunker down and be in their car. It's not too cold that you don't breathe. Yeah. That sounds good, actually. I could do that, I reckon. You know, they got showers at the parks and all that stuff, so they take their showers. But then, what, what they also do is they join a health club, like the YMCA or something like that. And then they take their hot shower and get ready and work out, and come back out, or go to their jobs. A lot of the college students do that, too. They're spending all their money for college, and they just say, Here we are at Luau. What's the name of this resort, Mark? Um, Come here. The Royal Hawaiian. The Royal Hawaiian. In Ka'anapali. And let's We're see. We're looking out. What's the island behind us? This is Onanai'i, right okay. here. And, um, oh, that's the other side of the island here. So it follows it round. Yeah, it's like where the clouds are hugging it. And then in here is a uh, luau so turned around. behind us. Because you see that little hump there? That's um, um, Which Kihei. One? All that. Oh, that's all Kihei over there under the cloud now. Yeah. Where we were earlier on when we were at the beach. Yeah. yeah. I think. That sunset's I'm pretty good. Around. Looking forward to this. Hey Jazzy. I'm sorry, did you want to drink this turtle? That's right, I got one. You got one? I got one, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I got ID'd. <laughs> I got ID'd. She gave me a stamp in the end, look. 
They wouldn't know, they wouldn't give me a stamp because I got no idea. <laughs> Too late now, we've already taken like two. Uh, you can you can have mine if you want. You can have mine.
Please give her a round of applause like your round of applause. Ah, and look who's coming back. Oh my. Hey gang, how did you enjoy the luau? Yeah, we loved it. You loved it. It was so good. It was awesome. It yeah. was excellent. <laughs> good review. Yeah. How many stars? How many stars? Seventeen. This many. Seventeen, 17 out of five. This many. <laughs> oh, this many. This many. <laughs> That's just done from the luau. I'm signing out. Oh.